Hello, today I want to show you Fire K1, their newest uh, budget uh, digital to analog converter with headphone amplifier. It is uh, probably the simplest device they've ever made and this review won't be actually very long. So just to show you how it looks and what it capable of doing. Accessory set is really simple, in box you will have K1 itself and short USB cable. So exterior is also absolutely simple. It is a small metal bar from one side there is a headphone out and small LED indicator. From other side micro USB slot. On the back side there is short clip but I'm not sure that you will clip it to anything because I don't know why Foyush can do it. So inside of this tiny thing there are PCM5102 digital tonal converter, simple headphone amplifier that able to output 75 milliwatts onto 16 ohm loads. Actually everything is pretty simple. Sound is pretty nice, it's of course not out of this world. Uh, because device costs about 40 or 45 dollars, it is good alternative to build in uh, sound cards in many notebooks. But of course, Fios elder models, even uh, Q1, sounds really better thanks to more powerful amplifier. Actually, this model is pretty good with IAMs that have nice sensitivity with sensitive big cans, but uh, it can drive power-hungry cans, of course. So sound is pretty balanced with uh, small impact on lower frequencies. Uh, highs are somewhat harsh, but not really strong and not really an issue. But anyway, sound, of course, is better than notebook built-ins. But uh, you should think. Should, will you want something better or not? So if the answer is yes, you should look onto E10, Q1 and if you need some simple device that you can carry everywhere with you, K1 is also nice companion for such usages. As usual, Fire make made really nice interesting device with affordable price, good sound and nice build quality. Thank you for attention.